The man MC, the apology video he posted. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's not sorry. <laughs> nah. yo, yo, he's sorry. Nobody that. rates that video. I'm not gonna lie, he's not sorry, man. He couldn't. You couldn't even look in the camera when he said like. I've, I'm an animal. Like he's just talking <laughs> to the guy. <laughs> he's, he, he's like, oh my God, this is crazy. The PR is just like, bro, just say Yeah. It. Back to the animal. Yeah. I don't, I don't, bro. How I'm do like, you apologize for that, fam? You're not, that wasn't an accident you, and you're not he sorry. He thought the 30 mil was the apology. Yo, fam, he kicked her when she was on the floor. Fam, that was some dirty work still. That's yeah. how you deal with a man. Diabolical. Was, like a man that you, you're like outside the club, like, yo, you know you're getting to a ones. Like, fam, that was your girl, fam. That's crazy. You just kicked her like... You can't yeah, even it's say It's also sorry. Cassie Fab. She's just pretty and soft, Bridget. Yeah. <laughs> even if she was ugly, it's your girl. You chose her. You know what I mean? Like, you I chose for her to be here. We're not supposed to be hitting y'all, period. So I'm <laughs> trying to tell you, man, this guy's talking about yeah, the ugly things, whatever. But yo, Cassie, yo, 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 can't, you, can't do that to you Cassie. I want you ugly pieces, bro. <laughs> Chill. Yo, bro. Holy. Can't be doing this, man. What was your response on the, on the apology video? Bro, it wasn't serious. He definitely, the yeah, PR definitely told him to, he had to speak up for something, bro. But yeah, he wasn't serious. He wasn't sorry. No, do you feel like videos like that they help the case or make it worse? Make it worse, bro. It definitely does not. <laughs> Dog, help at the least case. cry. You know, how Hardy was pushing for that tear. This guy bro, said the man, was, the man was like, "Yo, we put. He was trying to put the tear. Wouldn't come out. He's so evil. The tear wouldn't come out. <laughs> <laughs> Even the tear said, "Nah, nah, we're not yeah, helping you, bro." The man's like, "Holy fuck! Somebody tossed me an onion, bro. Like Jesus, Holy. not happening." Oh my goodness! I oh. don't think there's nothing you could do to make that better. No. No, no. Sometimes you just you gotta let your lawyers work. A lie, just don't even say nothing. Fam. Yeah, let, let them figure work. out something. Don't say nothing, bro. It's crazy because it kind of reverts back. So it's like, you see, not everyone saying, hold on one sec. Bear that, burps. that this guy works with the Jakes. Yeah. And mm. so, like, he's basically everything that has happened, he's not been found guilty of, and there's no repercussion, all that, because of his alignment with said entities. I heard mm. he just paid the people at the hotel to hold it down, and now it's beyond the because statute of limitations. Jakes, though, though. So these niggas just said, all right, we're putting it Yeah, out. but he's aligned with himself with certain entities which prevent him from facing certain repercussions. That's the story on the internet. You know what I'm oh. saying? Kind of in alignment shit. with, you know what I mean? The, the policing. Mm. You get what I'm saying? Because you would have never thought that. You would never thought. You should, I don't know. After a certain, after a certain amount of money, power, and influence, it's like, yo, bro, is there any way to na like? You almost have to go through them to navigate in certain ways. Mm -hmm. It's crazy because, like, police? yeah, I think at certain, at a certain level of, if you're doing a bunch of devious mm -hmm. things, one hundred percent. Yo, if you just make music in Harlem Shake in the video, fam, it'll be okay. <laughs> <laughs> like, but now you want to do all these other things. Now you need to buy them with you. It's kind of wild, you know. <laughs> I know it sounds a little absurd. But obviously, I couldn't, I couldn't fathom what she did for the justification of that beatdown. No, no, no. Right? He saw up. He saw up. <laughs> Yo, he chased her down yeah, the hallway in his up. towel. Like you need the details, yeah. fam. That's anger. Fam. And you gave her the eight town stomp. Like it was crazy. Y'all threw things yeah. at her after yeah. the fact. It was crazy, one hundred percent. Now, ooh, no, that's a little pushy. I was gonna say, is there any like? It's so crazy, obviously. You never beat your woman, but is there any like is there ever a time to like is that ever justified? Like I don't understand defending how defending yourself is justified. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah. like, following the video, asking that question like, is no, crazy. Right? Oh, like, like, oh, fam, you whooped her ass. That one we can't even stand now. We can't even yeah. say yeah. maybe this maybe six times in the time she's, to to, nah, she's there pressing the elevator trying to get up out of there, fam. And he's over what there. could she be doing, bro? Escaping. Yeah, she just wants to escape. She didn't steal nothing. She has money. What did she do? She left. I, I'm not lie. That was it still. So, yo, in his case, he has no reason. <laughs> like, in his case, there's nothing. There's nah, he, nothing. he's bugging out. Yeah. Brother, Brother Love was bugging out that night. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. He mm -hmm. was, the, 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 oh, man, Love was off the table that night. Did you hear his, his, his son's diss track? To 50? Yeah. To everybody. I think it was to a lot of people. You can't, first off, you can't start off saying no diddy. That's the first thing it started off with. Oh, yeah, yeah, oh, yeah. no. He's like, you guys can't say no diddy, and that's crazy. Cause you can't even tell, man, because now we're going to say it more. Like, you can't, it don't but even work But then the video like drop that. right after. I would take that down if I was him. He oh, shouldn't have made it in the first place. <laughs> that's a tell you, move. He has no talk. Buddy, you got caught in a sex assault raid. <laughs> like, okay. You have VHS. Nigga. <laughs> You're Involved. guilty. You free up and tell the man I'm stop saying no diddy. Like, yo, buddy, if you don't stay inside and be quiet. <laughs> like, yo, Fab, your dad has VHS, bro. Run up, bro. <laughs> it's it's oh, not good for you right now. That. Yeah. <clears throat> no, no, that that's that's def it's definitely an interesting situation that we're going through and witnessing in society. I think that um 
I don't, bro, I'm telling you, like, real life has become almost like a sitcom. Like, you're just wondering, yo, what's next? Because you have no idea what's, re what you really have no idea what's next and what's uh, next to be played for. If I were to make a, I don't know, a hypothesis on the outcome of how this man is navigating his situation, yo, I kind of don't feel like he's going to get, I don't think he's going to the bins, though. I feel like he might come out of this pretty clean. You think he's going to free from this? I think he'll free from this. That's crazy. I just, yo, fam, I think it's corrupt over there. Like, I don't know. He's been Hollywood, all Hollywood, yeah. How super do you feel corrupt. about this? Bro, it's super corrupt. I've done I've done research because I'm in the industry. You yeah, know yeah, I mean? yeah, absolutely. So, so it's normal, like, like for, like, people to hire up directors and stuff like that. Specific, like, I don't know how to say this in a respectful way, but they're all kind of, like, the same, like, certain, like, white folks. You know what I mean? Yeah, 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 yeah. There's yeah. a lot of, there's a lot of um, white folks I worked with that, like, even as an example... I had this dude um, that I worked with last year. He said he was uh, building up a movie. And he's like, yo, can you send me a lot of um, light skin, brown skin, dark skin um, females for, for roles? Mm -hmm. So I sent him like 50, 50 different females, right? And then I'm starting to see that he's uh, taking them out on dates and it's not business. And, then yeah, I, yeah, yeah, and yeah. I know these, these females, you know what I mean? So I'd ask him, I'm like, yo, is he taking you out on dates, stuff like that? And they tell me like it's mad awkward. He's he's doing specific things like like using his power and I don't know yeah, his yeah, wealth yeah. and stuff. So it's like that stuff is like normal to specific folks. It's like a cult type thing. Yeah. So I think Diddy's gonna free up from it. Like he's gonna get backlash, but it's gonna like fade out. Mm. They're gonna fade it out. Out of sight, out of mind, right? <laughs>